Allah says, وَمِنْ آيَاتِ أَنْ خَلَقَ لَكُمْ مِنْ أَنْفُسِكُمْ أَزْوَاجَ لِتَسْكُنُوا إِلَيْهَا وَجَعَلَ بَيْنَكُمْ مَوَدَّةً وَرَحْمَةً إِنَّ فِي ذَلِكَ لَآيَاتٍ لِقَوْمٍ يَتَفَكَّرُونَ And of his signs is that he made mates from yourselves. It's true. Yourselves. A mother, a woman gives birth to male and female. Imagine. And from this same progeny, Allah says, مَا خَلْقُكُمْ وَلَا بَعْثُكُمْ إِلَّا كَنَفْسٍ وَاحِدٍ You're all but one creation. Your parents are Adam and Eve, Adam and Hawa, Adam a prophet of God, sent to man as a leader, as a guide. Allah says, you're all from that one. Allah says, of his signs is that he makes mates from among yourselves. For what? لِتَسْكُنُوا إِلَيْهَا So that you have tranquility with the other. وَجَعَلَ بَيْنَكُمْ مَوَدَّةً وَرَحْمَةً And he has put mutual love between yourselves and mercy. God says, indeed, these are signs for people who reflect. إِنَّ فِي ذَلِكَ لَآيَاتٍ لِقَوْمِ يَتَفَكَّرُونَ Now, all you need is this one verse. You might be asking, what is Islam all about? Take a verse like this. Sit in a room somewhere. Stop all these cell phone text messaging, you know, chatting, the rushes of the world. Stop for a moment. Stop. Take it easy. Calm down. Relax. And ask yourself, who am I? What does this verse mean? What's my goal? Wow. God is giving me a goal. He says, your goal is to raise your status in the society. That when you get that mate, she better be good for you. Because she better be the one that's going to put tranquility in you. And you better be good for her. You better be worthy for her. That when you're with her, she has looked forward from childhood to come towards you as your partner. The one who is going to establish the next generation. Brothers and sisters, I have gone to weddings, marriages. And I'll tell you, in these weddings, I always look at the father and the mothers of the children who are getting married. And if there is a face that beams on those, in those faces that beam on those nights, it's the faces of the fathers and the mothers. They're so happy in general, of course, besides those, you know, mothers and fathers who don't want their sons marrying a girl, maybe because she's poor or she's from a different tribe, you know. God forbid she's from Tabneen and I'm from Bittajbir. You know, that kind. Then she's got a big frown. He said, oh my God, what happened to my son? He's lost. You know, and vice versa. No, not that type. The type that's happy. That's subhanAllah. Two mu'min, two believers are getting together. Salawat ala Muhammad wa